Hello everyone, this is Rocky. So in this video, I'd like to show you our newest 4K 60Hz modular mesh switcher with TV wall function. So right now we start from the source and right now you can see here we got a PSA and an HDMI output and also we got a line port here. So later we can use this line control with the web way to control the whole system and with also the uh, video wall setup. So right now you can see here we got the 18 by 18 modular mesh switcher and this is from panel. Under Real panel right now you can see here we got four 4K 60 Hz HDMI input card and all the input cards with the 3.5 audio embedded function. And this part is going to be the country and we have the line country and also the R32 and also we have the backup country, line port 2 and also the uh, comp, comp 2. And for the outputs we have 12 4K 60 HDMI 2.0 output cards and all the output cards we also have the 3.5 audio the embedded function so for the power supply we actually can support the redundant power supply so right now we're only using one power supply here but we actually can use another uh, power supply on this side so on this side right now you can see here we got uh, 12 monitors here it's actually already three video wall and a 2x2 two 3x2 two, and another one by two on the bottom side. So we get back to the uh, country PSA to say how to use this web grade to control the whole system and also set up the uh, TV wall function. So uh, as long as we got the line connector, line cable connects to the modular message switcher, and we just type the IP address in a browser, it's going to be 192. Dot one six eight dot zero dot eighty then we just press enter and then we need to log in the both of the username and uh, password is admin we just click to login after login we can see right now we have the manager switch center caption setup logout more all type of functions here and this part is going to be the input part so on input, we also can change the name here, like the PCI player, and we can rename the inputs for the outputs. We also can rename. And here we got some shortcuts, like the uh, do the switching. If you want to switch the PCI to all the outputs, we just select PCI and click here, and it's going to be switch all the outputs. And also same player. Can see it's actually can support the seamless switching and also we can do one by one this is actually about switching so we just go to the new function for the tv or function so for the tv or function actually right now we already set up three view tv or here actually we can delay them first Delay the first one, the first one, the first one. So we already clean, uh, delay the audio video. So right now you can see it's actually just like uh, modular matrix or the screen showing the same, uh, P same source from the player. So if we're going to add a new video and we can see here we got X and we got Y. So we just type, uh, we're going to do uh, two by two. So we just type two for the X and two for the Y. Then we just click add and you can see right now we already have a new video here. So we just drag the outputs to this one. So right now you can see it's already showing like a video or a two by two on this corner. And if we're going to do one more and also we can do just like do another two by two. Just add another two by two, and we just drag. Uh, but we need to notice that just because we cannot re get the output repeat. If you want to get a repeat, and it will probably like the output is not repeated. So we need to drag the output three, output four, output seven, output eight. And also, once we select the input source, we click the video, it will do the switching. Player. 
can see it's actually supposed to be seamless switching. And now if we're going to add one more and maybe we can do like one by two. So right now we have a one by two video here. So we just drag the, uh, these two here. Just because we only have um, 12 screens, so it's going to be 9 and 10. So we can see here, it's showing like uh, 1 by 2 video wall. Okay, this part is about how to do the uh, video function by this web UI. If we're going to delay this one, and also we just delay the third one, so we just type 3 here. And then we click light. You can see just back to the. Uh... Okay, thank you so much. They say about the uh, video function on our 18 by 18 modular mesh switcher. I hope you like this video and this product.